You might think house calls are a thing of the past. Not so here in Cleveland. On your side, health reporter Alicia Booth joins us now to explain. Well, you know, there is a big group of people who are still able to live at home, but for whatever reason are not able to get to the doctor. Often these seniors end up in a nursing home, which is incredibly expensive and not necessarily what the patient wants. And that's where house calls can make all the difference. Karen Parker isn't a salesperson. She's not a census worker. She's a lifesaver to families all over Cuyahoga County. Hi there, how you doing? Dr. Parker is part of the University Hospital's house calls program. Three days a week, she goes to her patients instead of the other way around. This visit to 83-year-old Annie Johnson is fairly typical of what she does. Mrs. Johnson has Alzheimer's and rheumatoid arthritis, both of which make it nearly impossible to get to the doctor. And when she does go, it can be terribly confusing and upsetting. But a house call is quite the opposite. My mother enjoys the attention, the company. And it's, it's like someone's coming to visit. <laughs> it's, you know, because she's kind of excited today. And Dr. Parker is excited to be on a house call. The first time I ever did it, I thought, this is fabulous. This is really how I have to do medicine. It is far from glamorous. She drives herself around in her own car, an old five-speed she picked up for the good mileage because she pays for the transportation herself. Much of her work brings her to the inner city, to neighborhoods with the highest crime rates in the county. Every once in a while, I'll ha send a glance around myself when I'm out in the street, but once I get into people's homes, they're glad to see me. They want to see, have me there. I'm helping them out, and I don't feel at all endangered, not even a little bit. The program is expensive to the hospital and largely possible because of grants, but because it cuts Medicare costs by keeping patients independent longer and out of nursing homes, Dr. Parker hopes that will keep her on the road. You see yourself doing this for a long time? Oh yeah. <laughs> this is my this is my favorite part of medicine right now is doing house calls. Definitely. And right now, about 300 patients are getting house calls through the UH program with three to five new ones a week. And the patient has to live within a seven-mile radius of the hospital. And you can find out how to qualify someone to get a house call by going to our website, newsnet5.com. And it's important to add here, this is largely based on mobility. It has nothing to do with your ability to pay. But having a big impact. Definitely. No question. Yeah. Thanks, Alicia.